Finally, after three months of preparation, we were off. My good friend Mark Couch, an Australian adventurer who just happened to be kayaking the length of the Mississippi-Missouri all the way to the Gulf, joined us for the first day of our own journey. A huge boost for myself and the team. The next morning, when we pushed Mark off, the enormity of our own challenge set in. Either he was paddling slowly, or the lake system ahead was going to take us an awfully long time. Our first days on the river were punctuated by stormy weather and high winds, all conditions designed to test a crew that had spent very little time on the water beforehand. Hour by hour we were adapting to our new surroundings, slowly getting to know each other in a new environment for all of us. Morning of day five. Ness is doing a running commentary on everything. There's cows. It's a big day yesterday, so everyone's a little stiff. How can I help you, Ness? No, I'm not going to ask that question now. Oh. I was going to ask Ness the needs paper. some toilet paper. Yeah. <laughs> David's m dad and Ness's mum have birthdays today, so I think it's time for a couple of happy birthday songs. Happy birthday, dear girl! <laughs> it's raining, isn't it? We're just taking over the boat! <laughs> <laughs> We're underneath the tarpaulin, sheltering from a storm. All of our boards and canoes are packed up and ready to go. I'm angry at the river. The river's definitely got multiple personality disorder. Yesterday it was beautiful, today it's raining, the day before that it was stormy. We just don't know where we are with the river right now. Common sense would dictate that you never get angry at someone with multiple personalities. <laughs>